The Ottawa Glandorf Titans have plenty of weapons, but Ben Westrick has stood apart. They expect a lot out of us, and you know, coming in, you always have to work hard. Nothing's given to you, everything's earned. He's one of those kids that just continues to get better, and you know, he's a hardworking kid. He's not one of those guys that he's not a he's not a big talker. You know, he's one of those things that uh, he, he leads by example and you know, the way he plays. And you know, I think the kids are you know gravitate towards him because they know how much time he spends in the gym and continues to get better. The 6'7 senior has developed his game and his strength in the last four years. My body's filled in a lot. I grew a lot from my freshman year to sophomore year, and my abilities progressed all, as well. I think it's one of those things he's starting to realize the potential that he has. And, you know, I think it, I, I think he's sometimes questioned himself of how talented he, he truly was. And I think he's starting to realize that, you know, there's there's life after high school basketball. You know, I think it's going to lead to a college scholarship and, you know, that education getting paid for. And I think once he started to realize that, I think, you know, he just continues to work hard and get better. And I think the sky's the limit for him. Ben and his teammates are a closely knit group built on teamwork and chemistry. Well, I, I think the best thing for me is just seeing him grow up. Uh, he was a kid that wouldn't say a word to anybody, and now you know he's one of those guys that's always you know cracking jokes with the guys, and really, uh, he's coming into his own. And you know, I think that uh, that type of attitude and demeanor uh, is really contagious, and I think the guys always gravitate towards him. I love playing with them. I've been playing with them from basically kindergarten to now, and they're really good friends. And it, translates on the court. Westrick has his sights on playing college basketball, where he looks to be a dynamic playmaker. You know, I think he's at his best when he can run the floor and make plays in transition. Uh, you know, he's one of those kids that I always tell the coaches two years from now, he's going to be playing his best basketball and his body totally fills out. He's going to be a physical specimen and uh, any program that's able to, you know, get their hands on him is going to have, you know, a kind of diamond in the rough.